Hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Today is Tuesday. Tuesday, um, 17th of January 2023. So this is my snacks. Okay guys, it's not good, it's not bad. I got uh, milk chocolate cashews. Yeah. Okay, let's eat it before the patient arrives. Open it, and here it goes. And then I have to cut it. I have to taste it. Mm -hmm. I have to share it. Adam, give me some. Come on quickly before I change my mind. Hurry up. Mm, light doesn't mean. Come closer here. Right mm -hmm. Come closer. Mm -hmm. Oh look, the curry is here. <laughs> it makes. Stop it. Here Come on. Oh, I know. It's really nice, guys. You can see. That's what it looks like. Cashews coated with milk chocolate. Milk chocolate cashews. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. I have to drink some water now. One. Two, three, four. This one's empty. We just drink a lot of water lately, guys, because it's good for you to clean your bladders and kidney and what's all your own, all your organs. Okay, just wait, just one. Oh my gosh, look at that! Hold on a moment, guys. So this one is more colder, and this um this one is colder and coldest. So let's go here. The coldest, not the oh not the colder. Are they just the same? One hundred. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Ah. <sighs> Nice. Adam. Mm. Oh my. It's not. It's not even recording. Yeah. <laughs> oh my After eating chocolate, drink water, and then exercise. I only got one. The other one is at home. This one is here. Yeah, so. Man. Eating chocolate. Yeah. Ten pound. So we just. 
Can you see guys? I'm blushing. Okay, one. See? I love watching rugby. Rugby sports. Rugby games. Yes, I know the rules. After everything that's happened in this game, the Wallabies have taken the lead. They've stormed back from 31-13 down to lead it by three. With two and a half. Oh, penalty! Penalty! Can you believe it? Well, I was called it for sealing off. I think it's plenty of fun on my city of Jersey 18 that's been hammered and like They're going for gold. The All Blacks will have a line out five metres from the line. Sam Whitelock has backed his team, backed his forward pack to come up with a winner. Down the back they go, taken down by Barry. We're going across the field. Ball on the ground. <laughs> They're fighting. This is a very controversial win. A win, a penalty. Well, they want it now. Has it got his hands on it? And it just went down there. And there's a split there where Pochetti got in there. Yeah, and then they. Well, so. Australians giving a bit of a hurry up here. See, so look at this one. Out. And all they'll have to do is win the line out. See, this is take up to take take a long time. They. Yeah, see? No. He's taking too long. That's massive. Yeah, taking too long, all right? Gold wants the ball. It's not a penalty. It's a scrap. Oh, they were trying to run the clock down. This is a sensation. Oh, he's caught it, hasn't he? He said it's a scrap. Well, he told them two or three times to hurry up, and they didn't. Super replay, okay? Then I time off, I time off. I switch, switch all the time. I say to, to your player, I switch on the time, and you play immediately. Okay. And you wait, you wait, you wait. So that's a strong for the All Blacks. Oh, boy. If the All Blacks get out of this, gee, can you imagine what the papers and the websites in Australia are going to be saying tomorrow? See? Ah! Uh, no. No, no, no. All Blacks have the chance. The scrum hasn't been a given either, TJ, so I'm sure they will take this for granted. Well, the last thing they want now is to give away a free kick or a penalty at scrum time to the Australians, because that will be game over. Akira Iwani picks it up off the back. Charges towards the line. The referee, I think, has been told that a man is offside. Oh, so the advantage for uh, All Blacks. Play advantage for All Blacks. The TMO is saying a man offside. So the All Blacks are playing under advantage. But they want the win. Scott Barrett taking just a metre short. Under penalty advantage. Dane Coles has a go. Yay! A short. Okay. Bodies all over the place. Brody Rattel can see the line. If dead side's on. Wow. Akira Iwani. Jordan goes on his own. Gets the ball away. Yay! Yeah. Oh my Way one. Has there ever been a finish to a test match quite like this? How did this happen? The All Blacks have stolen this one away in dramatic form. And what is it about French referees and last minute drama? Jolly Barrett all smiles. This is a remarkable win. The game is over.
The Australians are absolutely blowing up over that ball to a water scrum for time wasting. And Nick White's just yelling at the referee, you just cost us the rugby championship. and for Australia, just sheer fury. Oh, gee, I don't know if I've ever seen anything like this before. And yeah, we're not going to hear the end of it either. Well, a controversial finish, absolutely. And the referee is going to cop it as he leaves the field. We'll be back in a moment. Final score. The All Blacks, 39 to 37. Well, good evening, everyone, and what a fantastic test match we've all just witnessed with the Bledisloe Cup back here in Melbourne for the first time in 12 years. With the All Blacks winning tonight, they have retained the Bledisloe Cup, which is very exciting for them. Now, before we get to the lifting of the cup, to invite and welcome our official party here this evening. A big welcome to Mark Robinson, CEO of New Zealand Rugby, to Stuart Mitchell, the Chairman of New Zealand Rugby, to David Cody, the President of Rugby Australia, and to Hamish McLennan, the Chairman of Rugby Australia. Thank you all for joining us. Now we'd like to welcome both captains to the stage to say a few words and we'll start with the captain of the Wallabies, James Slipper. Hey, uh, firstly, I just want to thank the crowd of Melbourne. Um, absolute scenes out here tonight. The atmosphere was uh, was electric and it, it really carried us home and uh, that was a really classic Bledisloe game. And, uh, yeah, we're on the on the wrong side of the, the result, but yeah, I'm super proud of how we play tonight. And, um, once again, yeah, I've got to give credit to the ABs. Took it all the way and um, managed to get the win. So congrats, Sam and the boys. Uh, for our boys, this one's going to hurt, but we go again next week in, in Auckland. So thank you. Welcome to say a few words. To Sam Kane from the New Zealand All Blacks. Yeah, kia ora everyone. Uh, first of all, I'd like to thank all the awesome Kiwi supporters who came out here tonight. I think uh, there was a heck of a lot. A heck of a lot of black in the crowd tonight, and the boys can certainly feel it. Um, obviously, there's a, bit, a, lot, a lot of carnage out there with um, a fair few few injuries, um, both skippers included. So, but what a classic uh, players' load like test match. Um, gun, ding dong both ways, um, and yeah, to win on the buzzer, we're obviously um, hugely delighted. To the, to the Aussie boys, what a test match, um, it always is, it's always extremely tough playing over here, um, but we'll see each other again next week back in Auckland, so thanks again and thanks so much. been watching um, rugby New Zealand rugby it's all blacks uh, from um, last year from last um, October I think it was the the end of year believe this low cup it's a big one and it's silver <laughs> so I've uh, been eating chocolate so anyway guys I'm just gonna burn out my fat, my arms, just like the old blacks, blacks rugby players. <laughs> All right. Man, 
I can't believe these people who had a, a noisy car they just zoom away. Okay, guys. Thank you for watching my video. <laughs> Can I call you phone? Phone cable? My phone cable? What? Yeah. This one. Mm -hmm. My phone's at 6% and I need to um, charge it up. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Once you start eating this guy, this one here, you can't stop. See? It's just so yummy. Even if you're on diet. Yeah, you can't. So keep away from this. Leave it to me. Okay guys, thank you for watching my videos. Until my next videos. Adiós por now.